Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve the Amazon Prime video is experiencing black screen issues on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So if you're having issues with buffering or it just isn't loading the videos properly, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So we're going to start off by actually just going and restarting your computer. So if you're signed into anything, go ahead and just close and save out any open programs and applications, and then restart your computer. And now hopefully if you try and sign back into Prime, you should be good to go. If you're still having some issues, I recommend if you're using a VPN server to connect to the internet, I recommend turning that off and see if that might be the cause of some of your issues here. So open up the search menu, type in VPN, best match, come back with VPN settings, go ahead and open that up. And if a VPN is currently turned on here, so you see there might be an option for VPNs, so I recommend turning it off or disabling it. And where it says allow VPN while roaming or over meter connections, I'd recommend turning both of these off and then see if that has again resolved the problem. One further step we can try, close out of here. Open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, come back with command prompt, right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard. Shook up back a Windows IP configuration. Successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to go ahead and type in NETSH space Winsock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset. Again, exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter on your keyboard. Shook up back have successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Go ahead and close out of here and then restart your device. And you can also try using a different web browser as well. And depending on your web browser, you may want to consider clearing the cache data, C-A-C-H-E, and cookies. So you can search my channel for a tutorial on that if you still need further assistance, again, for any particular browser you're having the problem with. So, you know, that kind of goes hand in hand with trying a different browser as well and see if that potentially resolves a problem. You can also try contacting Amazon support. Amazon support's pretty good so you may want to try giving them a call and see if they can help troubleshoot your problem they might be having server issues for all we know so just want to keep that in mind guys and as always thank you for watching do a positive to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye